Welcome to the Sendbox demonstration video. This demonstration shows you how to configure Apple's device enrollment program with Sendbox configuration management. Apple's device enrollment program, or DEP for short, helps in easy deployment of multiple corporate-owned iOS devices. It automates MDM enrollment and enables you to configure devices without having to physically access them. Consider a scenario where David, the administrator, has enrolled his organization XYZ in the Apple device enrollment program. He has received a mail from Apple stating that his purchased iOS devices are now available in the Apple DEP portal. He now needs to set up the Apple device enrollment program in Zenworks. David needs to configure these devices by considering the following. Enroll the device to a specific MDM server, in this case, the Zenworks demo server. Reserve a device for Anna, who is one of the users in his organization. Mandate enrollment of the device to Zenworks and prevent Anna from unenrolling the device from Zenworks. And lastly, enable the supervision mode on the device to place additional restrictions. Before setting up Apple DEP in Zenworks, David needs to ensure that he has configured some of the primary tasks required to set up the mobile management component of Zenworks, such as he should have configured a user source, assigned an enrollment policy with DEP enrollment enabled in it, as well as set up an MDM server and the Apple push notification service. To link Zenworks with the Apple Deployment Programs account, David needs to add a DEP server in his Zenworks management zone. A DEP server links the Zenworks MDM server to a virtual MDM server that he needs to create in the Apple portal. While adding a DEP server, David first downloads the public key certificate of the Zenworks MDM server that needs to be linked with the virtual MDM server. If there are multiple Zenworks MDM servers in the zone, David needs to select the MDM server to which the DEP devices should enroll. In this case, all devices will enroll to the Zenworks demo server as David had stated in his objectives. David downloads and saves the public certificate which is required to encrypt the token generated by Apple while in transit from Apple to Zenworks. David now needs to visit the Apple portal to create the virtual MDM server and assign devices to the server. David signs in using his deployment program's account credentials. After completing the verification procedure, he clicks the Get Started link appearing against the device enrollment program and clicks Add MDM Server to begin creating the virtual MDM server. He specifies a name for this virtual server. To avoid revisiting the portal to add new devices that are not part of the current purchase order, David can choose to automatically assign new devices to this virtual server. David now needs to upload the public key certificate of the Zenworks MDM server that he had downloaded earlier. Apple will issue a token that he needs to download and link in ZCC. David has now created a virtual MDM server. To link the token generated by Apple, David navigates back to Zenworks and uploads the token to the Zenworks MDM server. David can validate the token by verifying the token information populated after uploading it. A DEP server is now created in the Zenworks management zone. David can go ahead and assign devices that are part of his current purchase order to the virtual MDM server that he has just created. To do this, he navigates to the Managed Devices page in the Apple portal. David can add devices as per the serial number or the order number, or he can upload a .csv file that contains a list of device serial numbers. David chooses to assign the devices as per the order number. He also selects the virtual server that he has just created to which the devices will be assigned. This is a one-time assignment. Since David had selected the option to automatically assign new devices while creating the virtual server, all newly purchased devices will be automatically assigned to this server. After creating the DEP server, Zenworks automatically syncs with the Apple DEP web service and discovers the assigned devices and populates them in ZCC. Going forward, 
To discover newly assigned devices, Zenworks will initiate a periodic sync once every day. Alternatively, David can also click Sync All to initiate the sync immediately without having to wait for the periodic sync. We have so far seen how to link the Zenworks MDM server to the virtual MDM server created in the Apple Deployment Programs portal. We have also seen how to assign devices to this virtual server and how Zenworks discovers these devices. For more information on viewing the discovered device information and enrolling these devices to Zenworks, click the specified link to watch part 2 of this video.